you think they can handle it, Bendy? Ben? Bendy! I have to try and help. I can't just stand around. Bendy, please come back. You need to recover. I'm okay, Mr. Felix. Really? We got this short stack. You've done a lot already. Still don't know what you mean. We can head down after I get the gear, Miss Kala. Oh, of course. Well then, time for round two. We'll be out of here in no time. Just one last nudge. Do you need any help? Don't worry, I'm fine. Oh shoot! You did it! You really did it! Mm-hmm. But now we have to... Uh-oh. We should probably... So what happens next? Oh shoot! M Mugs! Where is he? I have to go and- Cuphead, that's too dangerous! All that rubble! Well, someone has to! Watch out, buds. Oh come on, Mugsy! I can't lose you again, you dumb mug! <gasps> I did it! I got the piece! Don't scare me like that again, Muggsy! Ah, uh, bro! So cute! Phew. Thank goodness you're okay, Muggs! Mm. Oh! You okay, miss? That was a nasty fall. Oh, I'm fine, sir. I... Where's the gear? Oh, shoot! I must have dropped it! Maybe it's in the water? Oh, jeez. Huh? Did Bendy get the piece? <laughs> no, it's not real. You're gonna get out. You and this gear. You can do it, Bendy! It's not that heavy! I can make it! The gear, it's getting smaller! This is my chance! Just stay focused! Bendy, please get out of there! You can make it! You have to! They're counting on you! Boris, Mr. Felix, Mugs and Cups! Everyone is counting on you! You have to make it! Is someone going to follow or help Bendy? Come on, kid. Come on. Bendy, you have to get out of there! The heck is he thinking? <gasps> I got him! I, I think he's still breathing! Thank goodness, Miss Gala. G give him here so you can rest, please. Yeah. Don't worry, Boris. I got him. Go check on your wound with Felix, okay? Okay, just make sure he's okay. Mm. Mm. I'm glad everyone is okay, but what's the plan now? We probably are going to relax here for a while. I'm so glad you wake up. So, Bendy lost consciousness? You should be good to go, kiddo. Oh, don't worry. He's unconscious, but he's breathing. Aw, uh, is Mugs blushing? Also, holy shit, I forgot Boris was hurt this whole time! What? What? Nah! <laughs> I'm just happy he's okay, that we're all okay. I'm going to be asking about Bendy and no way can stop me. Is it okay, okay with Bendy being half demon monster? Like, bro, he can kill them all in one try. I've never seen Bendy like that, not even when we were little. It's nothing like I've seen from the ink illness. Well, he didn't seem bad, did he? He protected and fought for us. Honestly, I think it's like a power-up. He's... got a point. I guess you're right. Or Benny or Boris, do you have any idea how many more pieces you still have to look for? If I remember correctly, Benny said there were six pieces, so this is our first piece. <sighs> hey Cup, why do you care about Benny almost drowning? 
You should be happy, one last soul, Boris. To go, and you two and Mug should be fine again, right? Or was that I worry about the Ink Demon just an act? Why is Kapo so angry? I mean, weren't you worried about Bendy? Cuphead, is your eye better? Listen, I told him many times not to get attached, and I don't think now is the best time to discuss it, weird voices. Also, mind your own business about if I care. On a side note, there's another possibility, but, uh Anyway, my eye is okay, but still a bit blurry. But I ain't too worried about it. Hey, Muggs, how about you give Bendy CPR? You know, just to make sure he's breathing. <sighs> Go on, Muggsy. We won't tell. Oh, stop torturing the poor boy. If you don't mind me asking, how are the Brain Vinnies doing? What's their opinion on the new demon? They're actually pretty chill, but um, Craddy, on the other hand... Listen here, you vertically gifted son of a bitch! You think you can just come in here and act like you fucking own the place? <laughs> he acts like an angry dog. I'm sure he'll warm up to me though. Hey, Brain Bennies, we love you. Please send a kiss to your fans. Of course, doll. Mwah. Yeah, I'm not doing that. So, what happened to Kala? Is she gonna stay with you guys, or...? I know y'all are about to rest and all, but what about Kala? What will she do? Will you guys have to part ways? I'm sorry, I can't really join. I'm a sea creature after all. But that doesn't mean I can't visit. I'm sure there's a lake or a harbor near wherever they live at. And how is Caller Maria? How does it feel to be released from that place? Oh, it's amazing! I can finally let my tail loose in the water! Huh? Are you okay, Mr. Cuphead? Hey, Cup! You've been zoning out after you guys saved Bendy from getting the gear? Is something bothering you? I'm okay. I'm just keeping watch. Hey, Cup. You okay? You seem mad. Are you sure you're just keeping watch? You can tell us what's wrong. What do you mean, keeping watch? What's coming after you, Cup? Cups, are you okay there? Don't you remember that weird octopus hair? It could still be alive if it's separated from the monster Kella thingy. Well, we can be cautious now. But I'm just too tired to fight now. How much longer do you guys think it'll take Bendy to wake up? So, uh, how's Bendy? Is he gonna wake up anytime soon? Oh my god, is Bendy still out? Oh my god, please, someone tell me when Bendy will wake up! Let's hope he remembers what happens when he wakes up. I'm sure he'll be waking up soon. Mm. Wow! <laughs> Oi, fuck, he's so cute. Yay, the pens woke up! Hi, Bendy, are you doing good? He's up! Did Bendy have a nice nap? Bendy, you're up! Are you okay? Oh, gosh. How long was I out? What happened? Oh, uh, well... Oh, yeah! I had to give you CPR, Pipsqueak! No, that's not what happened. Cups, what the hell? Don't worry, that didn't happen. Cops! Oh please, many women, and probably men, have wanted to kiss me. The last woman you kissed was Von 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 back in high school. <laughs> Still though. Oh, God, no, no, no. <laughs> Bendy, you didn't even... I know, but it's the thought. <laughs> oh, okay. Whoa! Did Felix just make a boat back there? So now what are you guys gonna do? You got one ink machine piece. So I'm just supposed to believe that your bag turned into a boat? Yes. Yes. Yeah, like exactly that. Don't think about it too hard. See, I was gonna buy it, but then you kept going on about it. No, I'm not so sure. So, where are you guys gonna go now? Where are you going now? Do you guys know the way? 
Sorry, I'm just curious. Earlier I was thinking about how it is down here, so I thought there was an opening. Seems I was correct. I can feel fresh air flowing down the river. I think I have an idea of what's gonna happen. Is Kala gonna help and push the boat? That's right! Plus, it helps me to get used to swimming again. Make a warm-up! Do you guys know Roger Rabbit and Jessica Rabbit? Oh yeah, the rabbits. They're great at what they do. They do most of their performances at the Inconvenient. I've heard about them, but I'm not old enough to watch. Hey Cuphead, how's Jackpot doing? Where is dang Jackpot, Cuphead? Can we see more of Jackpot? How's he doing through all of this? I think he's doing alright. What is that? So, Bendy, how are you doing right now? And were you dreaming about anything? Also, someone watch Jackpot before he jumps in the water. Hey, Bendy, do you remember what happened or you still don't know? Could you all please stop asking me if I remember? Cause I don't. Um, Bendy, you might want to look at this. Huh? What the... What's everyone looking at? What's happening? You all look shocked. What are they looking at? What is it? Everyone okay? Whatever the fuck has shown up is clearly not good. Y'all gotta go now. What is this? It seems to be a hieroglyph. Fascinating. Is that symbol recognizable for you, Bendy? Bound to the ink, the gears shall move and clink, plush shall change and sink. The disc shall play and blink, the wrench will turn and tink. The illusion of living interlinks. Shade thee, shade us all one day. Shade the one who wields the ink. Shade the one who has been lost. Shade and erase the evil away. Shade and save the souls that were tossed. Some kind of prophecy. Bendy, what the actual fuck? Language! To be honest, I don't blame Boris for swearing. I mean, how did Bendy read all those hieroglyphs? Did Boris get scared? Or is that just how he talks? Boris, how is this his fault? He's as confused as you. First it was the monster form thing. Now you can read literal scribbles? What's next? Boris, I don't understand any of this. I'm sorry, but that was uncalled for. Uncalled for? Someone please calm them down, or they will destroy all that is nearby. Boris, please don't be mad at Bendy. He's just as scared and confused as you. Oh, come on, guys. This is no time to argue. You're in a creepy cave. Calm down. Okay, boys. There's things that need to be talked out. But there is a better time and place for it. Guys, guys, get the heck out of there. Felix is right. You guys can settle it later. But right now, you guys need to tell me what the heck that noise was. Bendy, my boy, please tell me that was your stomach again. Sorry, Mr. Felix. It wasn't. Uh, right. Then I suggest we all hold on right now. How is Oswald and his kids? Uh, we're doing pretty well. What the? What? Whoa! Is this an earthquake? Hey guys, something tells me this ain't an earthquake! The waterfall's cracking! Oh my goodness, is that the Questers? Are they okay? Is the city and people okay? Wait, isn't that Felix's slash the crew's boat? Er, bag? Is that who I think it is? Ah! Oh! oh my! I hope they land safely. I think they're pretty high up. I hope no one gets hurt. What happened next?
Are you all okay? We lived! So, is everyone okay? No one got hurt, I hope. Whew. Thank goodness you're all okay. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm soaking wet. Get your butt up. Seriously. Cup, don't be rude. My safety. We should probably get you somewhere else. But hey, you can stay at the tent for the night. Hmm? Wait, what did he say? I don't think we... <clears throat> we would love to! Aw, come on, Bendy. Give him another chance. He's giving you guys shelter, right? Bendy! Stop trying to push Boris away from his idol. It's nice of him to give a shelter, but you see how he acts around Boris. I've given him two chances already. Not to mention, it's like he's avoiding me and paying more attention to Boris. And I don't think that's just me who sees that. It's not that I don't want my bro to enjoy himself with his idol. I mean, we are on a quest with my idol. I just want him to be safe, and when it's Mr. Mickey, I... I think I'll have to set up a discussion with him later. Mandy and Boris, are y'all related by blood, or did Mandy adopt Boris? If y'all related by blood, would that mean Boris is half demon? <laughs> we had a good family before all of this. I may not have been related to them, but they took me in either way. So, yeah. I guess that answers your question. Wish they were still here sometimes, but... Bendy, are you okay in there? Yeah, I'm okay. Just hold on a second. Hey, where are you going, Bendy? Do you know where the others are at? Oh yeah, Mr. Felix is with Mr. Oswald, and Mr. Mickey is in the laundry room. Ugh, thanks, bro. Ugh, stupid water! Huh? Mm. <gasps> Shush! Oswald, are you fond of Bendy? He's a good kid. I haven't gotten to talk to him personally since, well, I only just started talking with him pretty much. But I do hope I'll talk to him soon enough. When he's ready. Actually, um, Oswald, I wanted to talk to you about him as well. Huh? Oh, well, I'm all ears. I'm sure you already know about Bendy's illness. I don't know if you'll react badly if he has another episode. I don't want it to make you spiral back to your old state. Are you sure he wants to stay with you for a small while? Felix... Huh? Felix, I've been getting better at the topic of that. I doubt I'll spiral back. If I know I can handle it, I disagree with you staying with us, but I do appreciate that you want me to feel safe about it as well. Thank you. Uh, okay. As long as you're positive about it. Oh, so Cup's finally noticed, huh? How are you feeling, you two? Apparently, from whatever you mean by Cup's finally noticed, resulted in them feeling like fighting. You goddamn traitor! Don't you dare say a fucking word! Uh huh? Where is he going to? Good question, Boris. Bendy, where are you going? Hey, um, Mr. Mickey, sir, we need to talk. Oh, well, I don't mind at all. What do you need to talk to me about? What exactly does Bendy want to talk to Mickey about? You've been weird with my brother since we met you. I need to know you don't have a weird thing with him. Plus, 
You've been isolating him from me. I'm sorry if I did something to you, but that doesn't mean you get to take my brother away from me. Oh, Bendy. I wasn't trying to take him away from you. This is a big misunderstanding. Then what were you trying to do? Well, we lost someone very dear to us from the illness. And when I saw you have it as well, I felt horrible because, well, I thought you would die. I just wanted to get Boris a home. In case that happened early on. I have nothing against you, I promise. Honestly, I just didn't want to get attached and lose you as well. I'm sorry if that sounds harsh. He's a good kid, and I just didn't want him to be alone whenever it happened. I see. I understand. <laughs> but you can't be doing the isolation stuff anymore. <laughs> Who knows how Boris would feel knowing this? Yes, I promise I won't. And we'll try not to do anymore. I'm glad you brought it up with me, too. Anyway, do you need any help with the laundry? Nah, I got it. You go hang out with the others. What's going on with the cup bros? He started it! No, I didn't! You were gonna tell! I don't care who started it. There will be no physical fighting within this tent. You got that, you buggers? You liar! <gasps> Maybe someone should check on that commotion? Liar! Wait, liar. Felix, I don't think it's a good time to interrupt whatever's going down. Shut Ugh, up, what's that puppy yelling about now? Guppy, don't be mean. He's just a kid. He's hey, a liar. you were you always complaining when we were you kids. Knew he was. Well, I don't anymore, and I don't see the relevance to this. What's happening with Mickey, Boris, and Bendy? He lied. Well, Bendy. ain't that a pretty I sight? Know, Boris. Let's get this over with. Do you not care? Mm. Let the boy of have this. I do, but you he need needs to, to let down. it out in some way, mate. Calm down! Calm down! I am not! <sighs> so, uh, anyone gonna calm Boris down to let Bendy explain, or what's gonna happen between the two is what I'm worried about. You're a liar, and you knew it! To think I didn't notice because I'm special. You didn't want me because I had potential. You wanted me because you felt bad for me, didn't you? I'm old enough to handle myself. Plus, I can handle my brother just fine. Since apparently you didn't think so either. In what mind did you think you could take me away from my own brother? I can't believe that I didn't notice you avoiding him as well. You know the illness isn't contagious, so you have no excuse to avoid him! You just wanted me in your effing circus because you felt sorry for me, just like everyone else does, to both me and my brother. It's no wonder you've been clingy with me too, to try and convince me to leave him behind? That was your plan, wasn't it? It doesn't matter if you get attached or not, Penny is still attuned just like the rest of us that does and should not change the way you treat him. It also doesn't mean you get to make him feel awful because of it. I see how he puts up with all this and you just to make me happy. Because Bendy is the best brother that I could ever have. That's why I'm not gonna let him die. But Boris, I didn't mean- It doesn't matter that you've experienced what I've experienced. You don't get to decide that I shouldn't have to grieve or try to help my brother. That's my decision, not yours. I doubt you've experienced how people are. Do you even know what it's like? No, what's like? Boris, please calm down. Mickey was trying his best to make sure you were safe, and he never meant for you to react like this when he found out, so please. Calm down. 
how everyone is when they find out that Bendy has the illness. They always either treat him and me nicely or like trash. Because they think Bendy is going to die soon anyway. So why not mess with him and his caretaking brother? They always tell us that they hope he'll get better. But I know what they think. They don't mean it one bit. They're just happy it isn't them who has it. So many people have told him so many times that he's gonna die. So what's the use? To the point that he even believes in himself that he's gonna die. To the point I'm the one who has to be believing and hoping he's not going to die for the both of us. You don't get to take that belief or whatever grief comes with it. I don't need your protection from it because I can deal with it. Even if he died, which he won't, I'm going to do everything I can to make it so that no one has to deal with this grief again. But what hurts the most is knowing that I thought you, of all people, would believe that he could do it. That he would survive. Because you always believe in everyone. So why is my brother different? I, I didn't mean to. I, I just... Just what? What could you just? I just wanted to help you, Ozzy! Huh? <laughs> Mickey. <laughs> oh dear. How's Ozzy gonna react to this? Oh, come on. Let's get you to bed, mate. <sighs> we gotta talk, Mick. <laughs> so, you felt this way for a long while, huh? Why didn't you come to me about it? <laughs> Mickey, it's okay to want to help Boris, but you can't just ignore Bendy because he might have the illness. It was hard watching you spiral over the last few years, Ozzy. I... When I saw Bendy had the illness, I couldn't bear the idea of a kid like Boris to go through what you did. What I went through, knowing I couldn't help you, teared me up so badly. I just wanted to give him a place, a family to support him. Oh, Mick. I knew I affected you badly, but... I didn't know how bad it actually was. I'm sorry I didn't realize it before. I'm supposed to be your brother. Look after you. Protect you. But I wasn't able to protect you from myself all this time. I'm so sorry, Mick. I promise we'll figure everything out together. The Walt brothers will always stick together. Mind telling me what's going on here, you freaking vermins?